May I come in? Ah, oh, hello, Eugene. Father! Eugene is here. You shouldn't sleep all day just because it's a holiday. Be down in a moment. <sighs> this is the best place to relax. You're busy? I thought today was your day off. It is. But when I'm home, messengers seem to arrive every other minute. That shows you're trusted and depended upon. If it were business, I wouldn't mind. But they're marriage proposals. They just keep coming in. I can't stand it anymore. <laughs> I think people see marriage with the bright and eligible Prime Minister of Halkita as very appealing. Why don't you wed Komachi? You can't be serious. Please, spread the word that I don't plan to marry yet. I'm just an old man. By the way, I received a letter from Michelle the other day. It looks like she's in Cassandra now. Did you get one too? Uh, yes, but I've been too busy to read it. That's not right. You should have. She'll be upset. <sighs> yeah, well, Michelle's not exactly my type of woman. <laughs> but if she's doing well, then I'm happy to hear that. treasure you stole from Cassandra, right now! Yeah, now! Hurry up! I won't let bandits take over Sigmund and Capel's homeland! No way! No how! Not today! Please, no! This is everything! Wait just a minute! I heard you snatched a woman, too! A damn thing to do, you scoundrels! Where is she? Don't tell me you pulled a stupid trick like hurting her, did you? Yeah, did you? Yeah, did you? No, no, we didn't even touch a hair on her head. But wait, I'll bring her here now. Get out of here now. You've got to go. What? You're forcing me out? That's not what I'm saying. But please, leave. Oh, I've been tossed out again. Look, it's Michelle. Hey, Michelle, what are you doing here? Why are you here? You see, I was doing volunteer work in Cassandra when I came across these bandits up to no good. Really? So, they kidnapped you. This woman is our friend. Speak up. What did you do to her? No! Wait! We didn't kidnap her! This lady just overheard us saying that one of the guys messed up and twisted his ankle. Then she followed us. She made us afternoon tea. She had us pray before meals. Now we got men who want to go home and help their parents. Please! Take this woman away from us! You're just embarrassed that I saw your softer side. My darling, it's been two years since the day you fell asleep. Everyone we traveled with is doing just fine. I'm making it through somehow, too. It's my sincerest hope that when you finally wake up again, you'll be happy to see me.